where Acadiana is. Ollie Bear. It is 640 on this Monday morning. Always fun things happening across Acadiana and Al Bear always seems to find them. He found them at the Main Cup in Lauraville. It's a preview of the Bougie Burger Back to School Bash. Al. Hey guys, we are back and look, we're with Shannon Gonsolin, uh, Gonsolin, Gonsolin Land and Cattle, right? Yes, sir. Okay, and of course, our good friend, Jonas Abear might be my cousin. Uh, so we've got these bougie burgers cooking now. What's uh, what what makes a what makes a burger bougie? <laughs> well, this is a grass-fed product that we produce here in Louisville, um, and it's about our meat runs in, in, in anywhere between 80 and 84 percent lean across uh -huh. the board. Uh, so it's a leaner product. Uh, not much fat. Fat acts as an insulator, uh -huh. so you can't overdo them or cook them too hot and too long because you'll dry them out real quick. Right. So, uh, the best way that we kind of tell people how to cook our meat down here is cook it like deer because deer has almost the same consistency. Mm -hmm. You don't want to overdo it. Uh, so we have, these are uh, a third pound patty that we're cooking this morning and also going to be that we'll be cooking for the, uh, for the event Saturday. Um, so. so let me ask you a question. One of my things I have a lot of trouble with is how do I season ground beef to make hamburger patties? Do you put the seasoning in and, and then make the patties or do you put the seasoning on top? It, it's personal preference, really? to be honest with you. Um, yeah, if you, you know, if you do the bash and you're kind of committed, mm -hmm. you know, to that seasoning, uh, a lot of times we just cook them and let the person kind of see them themselves as far as that goes. So you can get it either way. I think it's mainly personal preference. Now, your beef, it's a little different than what you might find in the store, which I think is very important. Explain that to us. Well, it's a grass fed, which makes it pretty much leaner across the board. Mm -hmm. uh, so the whole animals be about, like I said, about 80 to 84 percent lean. Uh, so the steaks and everything would be a little bit leaner. Uh, again, you don't want to cook the meat too long, right? Especially on a grill, um, because it, you'll dry it out too quick. So uh, low and slow is kind of what we, what we try. Oh, to do. okay, low and slow. I like Correct. that. Okay. Uh, now, Jonas A. Bear, bougie burger batch this Saturday. We're going to be able to get Mr. Gonsolin's great burgers. What time does everything start? 11 a.m. 11 a.m. And make sure you get your tickets because this is limited ticket availability. We're probably about halfway sold right now. Wow. Yeah, so call in or drive up, get your tickets as soon as possible. Okay, in 30 seconds, really quick, can we call you and get, buy a whole cow? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And we, that's the way to do it, right? Yeah, that's the cheapest and best way to do it. Cheapest and best way to buy the whole cow. Now, you don't have to feed and raise it. He's going to take care of that for you. Hey, we're going to go back to you in the studio.